You know, I was just trying to uh, just chill, have my coffee, which I'm, I'm having right now. But then I just see that we have a trailer now for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl Toast. So if you don't remember it, back in 2021, we got like Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, of course. Which, funny enough, launched the same day Sora was announced. So that that definitely had a bit of conflict. But yeah, overall the game was... It was like okay for like a bit, but I'm curious on what this sequel is gonna do now, and I'm hoping I see a lot more characters from like the older generation than some of the modern ones we had, aside from the turtles as well. So let's see what they uh, let's see what they cooked, because I also know this game leaks, so I think I saw a few of my favorites in the year already. Oh yeah, funny enough, if you didn't know, this game didn't even have voice acting at the start, which was insane. Alright, let's see. Squid- oh my gosh, they're doing the Squidward! <laughs> they're doing the Squidward joke! Oh, so I guess he's playable now! Oh my god, wait, 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 what? 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 It was the handsome Squidward? What? Wait. Can you play as handsome Squidward? Okay, yep, we already know these characters. Yep. Alright, so Squidward's playable, but... Wait, was Ang... Yeah, Ang was in the last one, and I know Rocco was too. <gasps> Crack a tower! Oh, wait! Alright, so they added Donatello. The future. Alright. Oh! Okay, that, it looks sick now. Alright, okay, so now we have all the turtles. And I guess more costumes. New campaign- Ah, oh, sweet! We get a campaign but Wait, let me see this, hold on. Wait, do we actually get to like- Are we gonna have something like subspace? Hold up, wait. They wouldn't, right? Wait, new characters? <gasps> Who we got? Finally! Yes! Yes! I was waiting for him! Finally! I've been waiting for Jimmy! He really should have been in the first one. The fact that- I, The fact that the memes- The fact that the memes for- Hugh being in this game were enough to get him in, but not his son are insane. Alright, release date. Uh, I guess no re wait, so you can pre-order, but there's no release date? Huh. Well, it's definitely looking a lot better than I thought. I, I can say that. It's looking much more crisp. It's like when, uh, it's like when they made, it's like when you saw that jump between, uh, Smash 4 and then Ultimate. It's like that, in a way. Where the model's, like, very improved. But yeah, it's interesting, though, because, like, now, so... Hmm. So we have Donatello... Raphael added, and then we now also got, uh, who is it? Jimmy and Squidward. Squidward looks fun, though. Squidward looks cool. But let me also see Jimmy now. Let me see what Jimmy can do. What did they do for my boy Neutron? Okay, um, alright, he's, he's looking fun, okay. Did they only do- Oh, come on, show more with him. Wait, let me see. Wait, let me see that UI. They showed the UI for a second. Huh, pretty good UI. I kind of like how they did would do it for, like, Smash, where you see, like, their, uh, the symbol of where they're from. I thought that's, like, a cool way to show off the, uh, the game they're from, or, like, the series they're from. But, huh. Yeah, I definitely think this game will have, will have like, a bigger 
uh, range now. Now that like Smash is like done, as well as I don't. I definitely am not calling you Smash Killer anymore. I think the Smash Killer thing definitely ruins it because like you're, it sets the expectations very high for a game like this. So I think with now how it is now with it adding more characters and like being a lot more detailed, it's gonna like have a much better reach than it did beforehand. So I'm at least hoping we do get more kill classics because I st so we are we already have Jimmy and we have Squidward. I did see before that we did get uh who was it? I'm trying to, guy, I forgot my name, but he, uh, he was like one of my favorites. It was, uh, Vlad, Vlad Plasmus. Yes, Vlad Plasmus. I don't know how his name was like, throw, um, not kill clicking with me. Cause like he, he's called Vlad. So obviously he was a vampire in some sort, but I'm hoping, I, I, we really need to see that like Fairly Odd Parents be in there. I think Fairly Odd needs to be added. Uh, Fairly Odd is one I want. Maybe... Huh, I'm trying to think. What would just be a weird one? You know, I think we should add, like, the, some DreamWorks characters at the very least. Like, because there are some that had Nickelodeon shows. At least, like, if we could at least get maybe Back in the Barnyard or Penguins. I, I, I feel like the Penguins would be a hard reach, but at least give me Barnyard, please. I want Otis more than anything. I said, I forgot, I did not even like try to check the article that IGN posted for this. So let me see here. So it says in the single player campaign, you'll be aiming to stop Danny Phantom bad guy, Vlad Plasmus from conquering the Nickelodeon universe. Oh, oh, okay. This, this actually might be good. I like how this is. That that that's actually this guy definitely has my attention now. Cause this definitely sounds a lot like how they did with Nicktoons Unite. Cause in the original plotline for Nicktoons Unite, it was uh, Calamitous working with Plasmus, Plankton, and uh, Crocker to conquer the universes. So Vlad getting his time to shine as the main villain though. That. That is sick. I like that. That is going to be interesting. I'm glad that they are going to go in that direction, but... Now I'm curious, though. Do they... They don't have many villains, though, in, the, in this game, do they? Because I'm trying to think. They only have... Shredder, right? Because let me see the roster. Let me quickly see the roster for this game. Okay, so... Yeah, I'm only seeing... Uh... Shredder. And that's it. Shredder's like the only villain that's in this list. So, how are they gonna just have him be like the main villain in all of this? I, because I feel that they could definitely add more villains though. Because I, I'm not sure who they could add for like Jimmy's side if they do want to add Calamitous. Because I feel like he would be a bit hard to like give a move set to. But maybe they can do Plankton. At, maybe they can somehow do Plankton. They can do... Crocker, I know, would have a cool move set. Uh, let me see. Who else on this list could work? Uh, I'm not sure they would do... Zo I feel like it would be weird to just have Zuko in there unless they would do, like, an Echo situation. And I'm not saying Zuko would be, like, the villain, but I feel like if they added a Zula, that would work. So I feel like it would be... Yeah, I feel like it would be like this. Like, have two different, play two different styles for or like skins so like you could either play as Zuko and Azula so I think that would work and honestly would it I get what's funny is I don't even see Zim working with uh Vlad because of that one game where they were actually working together in uh Nicktoons Globs of Doom so maybe they'll add Dib they can add Dib and <clears throat> Yeah, I'm not seeing any other villains they could add at the moment. Let me know what other villains they could add for this game, because I'm curious on what they'll pull off for this.